Okay, so this is a really cool coin bank. I want to show you real quick. I will warn you, uh, some of the other reviews saying that the speaker is really loud. It is. Um, at the same time, you can just put a you know piece of tape over it, electrical or even a duct tape, a small thing. Um, watch. So you can quiet it down if you want. So it's not a big deal. The coins themselves, they just uh, go back in the chute here. It doesn't make any noise, but um, the bills, and this is where people are talking about. You can stop it by pressing the key button. That song, by the way, is, um, I think it's a Japanese anime called Doraemon, uh, Cat Without a Year. It's it's actually a really cute um, anime. Anyway, um, by default, when you put the batteries in, the default code is 0000. If you press it wrong, um, that was in Chinese, or I don't know if it's Mandarin or Cantonese. Code is 5555 that I changed it to. So... I'm going to change this to the English beef sound, um, is also English. If you want to change it, you want to hold the star button, new code, let's do one, two, three, four, pound, and it's set. So if I press the, the old code, so we'll do one, two, three, four, and you can open it. So. I think, you know, it's pretty cool as far as uh, being able to teach your kids as far as like, you know, remembering like four digits. Uh, nowadays, everything is like kind of a key code, uh, even like our entryway uses a keypad. So with that said, it's I think it's a really cool uh, way to save money. Um, I love the automatic function. Well, it's kind of reminding you the failure. Of... So again... If you want to stop the music, you can just press one of the buttons, but um, really cool piggy bank. So uh, yeah, definitely check it out.